The shoot sack is a lens bag. I already own a camera bag and a suitcase where I bring all my equipment on location. But once I go shooting and you know the location I want to go to, I don't want to you know bounce back and forth to my suitcase to get my stuff. I want to make sure that my lenses are right next to me, and that's where the shoot sack, this, this of course, this lens bag kicks in. The material is neoprene. Now, what does that mean to you? That means elastic, light, thin. You know, you can pretty much mistreat this bag. Now, here's a front view, and I'm going to show you the side view of this. Why? Because it's very thin. As I said, very thin, and it you know gives you the view of like pretty much the whole of the bag. Now, the front, as you can see here, there's two dividers, one here and one on the other side, and we have this kind of divider also in the back. Now, the back is mainly made for little things like SD cards and cables, and uh, the front cover does not cover the back of this bag. Um, what does actually close and make it seal pretty much are these three little white buttons. You just put your stuff in there and close it with a white button. As you can see, easy peasy lemon squeezy. Now, on the other side, um, one thing I want to point out again is how light this thing is. I mean, I was a little afraid once because I, when I opened my suitcase, it was bent. I mean, this bent. Now, I want to take a closer look at the, uh, you know, the lens area where, we, where you put your lenses. Let's go look inside. Now, right here, this is where your lenses go. And that's how much space you have. Now let's go a little bit closer here where I want to show you where the divider is. As you can see, they made this little extension so that lenses actually fit in your bag. Without A, risking to break the bag, and B, well, it's so so snug that the lens is not going to come out. Now let's talk about the cover. Did you know it's removable? Yep, it is. Are you ready? One, two, three. And there you go. Now, why is it removable? Because, you know, the shoot sack offers different kinds of covers for you to personalize your style according to your photography. Now, one of the main questions or let's say worries I get from people looking at me going around with a shoot sack uh, is, is it robust? Has it been sewn together very well? Or, uh, you know, can you trust the product? And I'm going to just say yes, yes, yes. I mean, I have been mistreating this very bag you're looking at right now in ways you can't even imagine. I fit a whole 5D3 with lens in it, and it was not I was not supposed to do that. But it has, you know, survived. Yep. Okay, so I think I gave you the complete tour. Why don't we see this bag with some lenses in it? Let's go and put this nice 85 in there. Now, I don't put any lens cap or nothing. Again, I want to access these lenses fast. We're going to put a flash right over here. And a third lens in the middle. Right there. Okay, so this is what it looks like from the inside. And a one, and two, and three. I'm sure it's pretty much what the logo stands for right there. Now let's go put some stuff in the back of the bag. We're going to put some SD cards right in the middle. And again, these are small pockets. You don't exaggerate to put something big. And some batteries. And there you have it. All right. And now here's my nice, fully loaded shoot sack, ready to go shoot. Yeah, there you go. My pregnant shoot sack right there with my babies. All right. Now let's go outside and shoot some so I can show you how fast this is. All right, let's see, one, two, three, go. And voila, done. One goes in and the other one comes out. Now from shoot sack perspective, one goes in, the other one goes out, easy peasy. I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.